Hope for Grove Falcons. Today is Tuesday, May 5th, 2020. Happy Cinco de Mayo. If you're hungry and you need a breakfast, make sure you go to your nearest public school between 8.30 and 9.30. Or if you're, if you're need, in need of a lunch between 12 and 1. And of course, there's always the lovely bus that comes by and drops off food. I cannot express how much gratitude that I have for all the bus drivers and the cafeteria workers that have diligently been um, doing this for over a month now. Thank you from the bottom of my heart. Yesterday, I forgot to answer the riddle, which was what has a face and two hands, but no arms or legs. If you guessed a clock, you are completely correct. And today's riddle is what five letter word becomes shorter when you add two letters to it. As I said earlier, today is Cinco de Mayo. And Cinco de Mayo is a celebration that some here in the United States celebrate, but it's really a Mexican celebration. For, for many years, I believed, and I know a lot of other people believe, that it is, it is the celebration of their independence, like uh, the United States 4th of July, but it's, it's actually not. It is a celebration of a huge win in a battle that they fought against Napoleon's army from France. So Mexico had uh, incurred a debt with the country of France and they were unable to repay it because they were so poor. And Napoleon didn't like that, so he sent his army over to um, take over Mexico, I believe. and in um, 1862 at the Battle of Puebla the Mexican people defeated Napoleon's army against all odds and so this celebration is a celebration of their perseverance so that's pretty cool isn't it it's good to persevere because when you persevere you end up usually getting where you want to go anyway <clears throat> what five-letter word becomes shorter when you add two letters to it? The word short. And I am going to leave you today with Franklin Delano Roosevelt's quote. When you get to the end of your rope, you just tie a knot. Anyway, I hope you all have a fabulous Cinco de Mayo. Until the next time.